Ah, oh, what is up everybody? Welcome back to a brand new video. Hope you're all doing well. I'm on to my second uh, coffee of the day so far. It's only eight o'clock, um, but I'll tell you one thing I do love, and that's my neighbor's car, car alarm going off at three in the morning. Absolutely shocking, you know? You, just, you know when you just hear a sharp noise and you're wide awake? You know, you're absolutely wired for the rest of the night. So yeah, I'm not feeling, not feeling too awake this morning. So um, yeah, the video, if I do uh, waffle on in this video, at least I've got an excuse this time. But yeah, I hope you guys are doing well. I hope you guys have had a good week so far. As you can see by the title and the thumbnail of this video, I'm gonna be taking you guys through five different high protein snacks. You know, they're, they're perfect for trying to build build muscle, gain weight, you know, lose weight. It's all it's all relevant to, it's all relative, sorry, to, to what else you eat in the rest of the day. Um, but for me, in my personal experience, these are five pretty cheap snacks. Um, some of them are slightly more expensive than others, but on the whole, they're fairly cheap. Um, obviously, I don't have them all every day, but, but for the purpose of this video, I'm gonna be showing you them all today. Um, so yeah, sit back, relax, and enjoy this video. Right then, on to snack number one. Now, before you guys start disliking the video for not seeing any meat sausages, you know, proper meat, um, these are absolutely delicious. If you haven't tried them, go give them a go. They are the corn range cocktail sausages. Uh, the protein is pretty decent, these. I was quite surprised. We've got, um, so it's 180 grams. Per 100 grams, we've got uh, 8.3 grams of protein. So, you know, there's, there's about sort of 13 to 14 grams of protein in this whole pack, which for a snack is, is pretty decent, to be fair. You know, you don't always have to get your, you know, your proteins from, from you know, from meats. Um, you know, you can get sort of the uh, the alternative range as well. I typically don't have a lot of the alternative range, but I discovered these the other day and these are absolutely unreal. I think they're about £1.25 in Tesco. Um, I'm sure you can get them from other places. But yeah, per four sausages, we've got 134 calories. And I think in here we've got about... Yeah, about 10 sausages. So you're looking at about maybe 400 calorie snack. So pretty high for a snack, um, high in protein, fairly high in fat, um, but these are probably best, you know, if you're on a bulk, you know, you, they can be implemented into a cut as well, but obviously the more you have, the less calories you're gonna have to play with for the rest of the day. But yeah, definitely give these, uh, give these guys a, a go if you haven't already. And uh, yeah, let's enjoy them. Moments later. So that's snack one all done. All, uh, I think 12 sausages and all. I'm pretty stuffed to be fair, like I've literally just had breakfast. Um, but they were absolutely delicious. Managed to get them down. Like I said, fairly high in protein, a very cheap snack, good in calories. So particularly good, this one if you're bulking. Um, some of the protein snacks later on are a little bit, uh, you know, a little bit lighter, a little bit less calorie dense. So um, yeah, keep your eyes put for those. And I'll catch you guys for the next snack. Right then, on to snack number two. We have got the Tesco's Vanilla Crunch Bar. Um, forget the grenade bars, guys. These are one of the nicest protein bars you will ever come across, and also one of the cheapest. I think it's about £1.20. Uh, we've got 19 grams of protein, a little higher in the fat. We've got 220 calories in total. Think about 10 grams of fat. So yeah, if you've got macros to play with, definitely worth fitting in. If you haven't, make the room. Um, it's absolutely incredible. So I'm going to enjoy this, and I'll catch you guys for the next snack. Right then guys, on to snack number three. So I've just had my lunch, it's just gone one o'clock. I actually tend to get these quite often now. They are the chicken satay uh, from Tesco. You can get them as part of the meal deal. I usually just buy them just on their own. I think it's about a pound, uh, 87 calories. So very, very lean this one. I believe, yeah, per 100 grams, there is 20 grams of protein. This is 40 grams. So just under 10 grams of protein for this pack, which, you know, for, for a tiny little pack like this is, is a perfect, you know, protein boost. Now, obviously in a typical day, I don't have all of these snacks. Um, as I mentioned earlier, you know, I might have typically maybe one to three of each of these that you'll see in today's video uh, each day, you know, probably more like one to two. Um, but yeah, you know, it costs about £10 a week for the snacks that I have and it just tops up the protein because, you know, when, you, when you're trying to get in a lot of protein each day, you know, I weigh over, over £210. So you know, I'm, I'm looking to get sort of between sort of 200 to 220 grams of protein. And if I was doing that just through my meals, it would be a hell of a lot of meat. Um, well, not necessarily meat, but just a head of a lot of, um, you know, different food. So I personally, I prefer and I find it easier to get in quite a lot of snacks like this, you know, just to go alongside the, the main meals, um, you know, because I probably get sort of between 30 and 50 grams um, of protein through my snacks. Um, actually a little bit more with the protein shakes and then obviously the rest I just make up through through meats and uh, you know trace proteins through you know things like pastas and rices and things like that. Um, so yeah, anyway, let's uh, eat these and I'll catch you guys after. I'd say that's definitely one of the uh, one of the easiest snacks to get down. It's very light. It's very lean. Um, 
Actually, I say it's very lean. It's, it's very, uh, very small. So I just assumed it'd be lean, but it's five grams of fat. So, you know, again, if you're bulking, five grams of fat for a snack, absolutely fine. If you can, you know, it might be a little bit of a different story. You might need to sort of juggle a few things about um, to fit them in, but it's very, very tasty. You can definitely get leaner um, packs of chicken, but this was, uh, yeah, chicken satay. So the fat's coming from the satay sauce. Um, but if you just have some, you know, some plain chicken breast. I know Tesco's do like a char grilled chicken breast um, with their meal deals as well, which is pretty tasty. Um, but this is definitely a lot better. So, yeah. Get yourselves down to um, any supermarket, really, guys, and pick yourselves up one of these because they are one of the best snacks. Anyway, I'll catch you guys in a bit for the next one. So then, as soon as I get home from work, what I like to do is have a one scoop of protein. Uh, strawberry is my flavor of choice at the minute. You know, it's been a couple of hours since I had my last meal, and this is honestly probably one of the cheapest protein hits you can get. I usually get the 2.5 kilo bag, which works out to, I think, about 23p per 20 grams of, uh, of protein. So. You know, you compare that to sort of like a chicken breast, it's, it's significantly cheaper, way more convenient as well. And, you know, when you're trying to get a lot of protein in, definitely there's no harm in getting a scoop or two in, you know, each day, really. That's that's what I tend to do. Um, although, don't make the mistake of that I do in order like a big five kilo bag of one flavor because you get incredibly bored of it. So it's definitely worth getting sort of a few flavors, you know, what you know, a couple of one kilo bags. And uh, yeah, that'll tide you over, really. But yeah, I'm going to enjoy this. And I'll catch you guys later on, probably later on this evening for my final snack. What's up people, so it is about half past nine and I'm so angry, it turns out I've left uh, the final snack at work in the fridge. Um, so I was planning on having it at work, but I decided to have something different. Um, I completely forgot it, so this fifth uh, snack is gonna be a virtual one. Um, so I'll put it on the screen for you up here. It is one of the best snacks, one of my go-tos at the minute. I think you can get four of them or three of them, no, I think four for three pounds. So it's about 75p per one. These are incredibly tasting. Uh, 20 grams of protein in these and pretty lean, um, lots of different flavors. I had the blueberry one. Um, I was so angry that I forgot it, but yeah, it is what it is. So I'm gonna have, a, well, I'm not gonna have a snack. I'm not gonna have that snack tonight now. Um, but yeah, definitely, definitely get yourselves to the shops and try those. I think my favorites of all these snacks has probably got to be the yogurt and the protein powder. Protein powder purely for the convenience um, and the cheapness and the yogurt for the flavor. Um, but of course, all of these snacks are great. You know, all the snacks are good and can be utilized in, you know, either a bulking phase or a cutting phase. You know, it just depends on, on what your macros are and what your, you know, what your specific targets are and what your aims are. Um, but yeah, I hope you guys have enjoyed that video. Uh, it's probably a good thing I haven't got it because, you know, you probably don't want to watch me eat something again for like the fifth time in a row. So yeah, I'm going to end the video there, guys. Uh, sincerely hope you enjoyed it. Don't forget to like the video, subscribe if you're new around here, and I'll catch you guys next week for the next one. Peace. Uh -huh.